Hello, I am on my way to Stone Tail Horse Ranch, where I am course training my tier 8 horse for awakening chance. And uh, Stone Tail Horse Ranch is located in Medaya territory. It is uh, underneath Usha and above Tarif, sort of in between the two. I will auto ride there and when I get there I will continue the video. And here we are, finally arrived here. Once you are here, you need to talk to stable keeper Gula and you need to check in your horse. Now my horse is already checked in. When you check in your horse for the first time, you will see this menu and you need to choose Courser Training. Once that is done, this is what you will see on your screen. Your Kragdala's Origin Stone will be automatically put here on the top, but it will still stay in your inventory and it will remain there until the very end after you try to awaken your horse, then it will be taken out in either case, if you fail or succeed. Your experience will be collecting around this stone, as you can see right now, I'm at 60%. There are three different categories in which you can train your horse, skill, elegance, and strength. And all together, you will need 200% of experience of all of these three categories combined. It doesn't matter how many percent of it you will get, as long as all of them together are up to 100%, you are good. Right now my skill is at 28, elegance at 19, and strength at 13. Now it is said that if you desire to have a Pegasus, then you should be training your horse more in skill category. If you want your horse to be unicorn, then you should concentrate on elegance skill training. Strength is for hell horse training, but North American servers don't have hell horse yet. So for now it remains neutral. You still need to train your horse in strength, but it won't sway uh, your horse to become either Pegasus or unicorn and of course not Hell Horse yet. I don't know how true it is, it's all RNG and depending on your luck that day if you will get Pegasus or Unicorn but that's what it said, that's what I read online. I would be perfectly happy with either one, Pegasus or Unicorn, to me it doesn't matter but um, now if I think about it, I'm, I'm leaning towards Unicorn a little bit more but like I said, I will be happy with either. Also, to train your horse, you will need certain items. And here all of them are, not these though, not the leaves, but these four. And um, they will be highlighted according which category you choose. You see how it's changing? Each of these items will give you 1% of training. So right now I have 20 of these stone tail fodders and how to make them I've made a video I will link it for you uh, in the description so I have 20 of these which means I will gain 20 more percent of training once I use them I also have 23 of breezy conch seaweed so I will gain 23 percent of training for this and these uh, you can gain by fishing. I actually caught a few of them myself. Most of them I bought on Marketplace, of course. They are very rare. Catching them yourself will take you forever. For strength, I have deep blue hoof fruit. How to obtain deep blue hoof fruit, I also have a video and I will also link it for you in the description. And I also have pure forest breath. You can use both of them. And uh, pure forest breath, it's a low drop from hunting. If, if you do hunt, it will be a good chance that you can 
find these. We can also buy them on Marketplace or Camaselvia region mobs drop them as well. If you go there to XP or grind, you can obtain them that way. Okay, so let's choose our first category, which will be skill. It will highlight our stone tail photos for us. You right click on it. You choose the amount that you want to use. I'm gonna choose max. Okay. All of your stone tail photos will be right here now. You press training and the magic happens. And automatically I went from 60% to 80%. Okay, let's go to elegance. Highlights my breezy conch seaweed. I'm also going to choose max and press training. And it took me to 103%. Yay! Okay, and the last one is strength. Let's do pure forest breath first. And we have left our tea blue fruit. I'm all out of items. I still need 55% to reach my 200% goal, which means I need to obtain more items for training. And it takes a little while. Some of them I buy, some of them I make, and for some I complete quests. So it's going to take a little bit of time. But um, hopefully next time I am here, I am ready to awaken my horse. And I will show you how I will do that. And if I fail or succeed. It's going to be my first try and I'm like okay I'm pretty sure I'm going to fail but there is still that little bit of hope you know that maybe some miracle might happen and I will succeed in my first try. Anyways thank you for watching all of the links on how to obtain or make the items I will link in the description if you like to watch them uh, please do that. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.